What's going on, Throne Army? Uh, sitting at the airport in Cleveland, heading home after the Christmas break. And uh, as coming here and as going home, my plane is delayed quite a bit of time. Coming here is about two and a half hours, and now going home is already over three. Um, and I figured I got nothing else to do, so I'll make you guys a little video talking about what's going on. It was kind of all over YouTube already, and I got really nothing else to watch or comment on. So I figured I'd do this, and I can't really do a lot of stuff that I have to do because uh, I, I need my big computer, and uh, I just have a laptop with me. So uh, I figured I'd just talk to you guys for a bit. Um, I had a great Christmas. had a good time being home. Um, you can see behind me is Cleveland. Got some snow on the ground. Um, kind of. You can kind of see it way back there. But we got a little storm yesterday. We almost got a foot, they said. Um, I had a good time. I went out and drove in it. I just had nothing to do. So I was like, I'm just going to go for a drive in the snow. Nobody was out. So um, just had fun playing around in the snow. Uh, I wish I still had my Wrangler. That would have been a lot more fun, just like go over stuff. But um, so I did that. Um, and then I just ended up going to the Apple store because we had nothing else to do. And uh, I needed a big Apple upgrade uh, with doing all the stuff for you guys. My, my computer just can't take it. And so I, I had my big uh, iMac desktop. And that thing's just getting bogged down with encoding video, especially with the new camera um, and all the mm -hmm. quality that brings into play. So I picked up a laptop because I felt kind of disconnected um, from work and from you guys uh, while I was home. And I kept trying to steal my mom's uh, computer to be able to do stuff because mine's pretty old. Uh, I'll show you guys a message Monday the difference between my old laptop and my new one. I'm not hating on my old one. I've had that thing forever. It got me through college. It got me into college. I made my portfolio on it. I made my thesis on it. Uh, I started Throne on it. It's, uh, it's very near and dear to my heart, but can't update it anymore and uh, can't run any of the applications that I really need to run to edit things. So time for an upgrade and uh, really happy with it so far. But the thing I'm most happy with is the new phone. The iPhone 5 is so legit. Uh, I'm waiting for the jailbreak. I was kind of, I always jailbreak all my Apple devices and I was waiting for it and it seems like it's coming soon and I figured I'd just get it anyway and see if I didn't need to jailbreak it but there's a lot of things that uh, I think could be better and uh, I know there's jailbroken products out there that uh, from the, the Cydia store that can definitely help but besides that it's smooth, it's fast, it takes amazing photos, amazing videos so I'm extremely, extremely happy with it. Um, but that's about it. Um, played some hockey while I was home, not a lot of guys play lacrosse at this time of year so Played last night with some uh, kids I played against in high school, a lot of D1 kids. I uh, had a lot of fun, a lot of really talented skaters out there. Uh, we had a pretty good goalie too, and that was, that was a good time. Um, and then I don't know, what else? Got the new computer. Shot a lot of video um, of my family and stuff, and that was a lot of fun. Learned a lot more about uh, handheld shooting, which I, I want to learn more and add to the, uh, the, our, our videos. I know uh, I was just on the phone with Chris. Um, thinking about the uh, Super Smash Lacks coming up uh, in the next week or so. We're planning to do it. And uh, I kind of want to add some uh, more dynamic elements to it that I think you guys will find more entertaining. So uh, I need to maybe pick up some stuff slash engineer some things uh, and come up with some cool, really cool shots. But uh, that should be pretty cool. And what we have planned for it, I think, is going to be really awesome. Uh, and I hope you guys uh, are looking forward to it. Those are some of my favorite videos to do. They just take forever to make. And... Uh, after a day of you know stringing and getting the mesh orders out and doing the stringing videos, you just kind of you're kind of beat and you don't want to edit videos anymore. But uh, those are ones that I really look forward to editing them. And uh, so hopefully, if I get home tonight, I was supposed to get in at like six. I'm probably not going to get home at like eleven. Uh, so no one's going to be in Brooklyn working, which kind of sucks because I wanted to get uh, kind of a start on it. I'm going to be working this weekend because uh, we've been working really hard on stringing. So if we have your head. Um, uh, the the stringing should be out soon. Um, we did put up three weeks ago turnaround um, right before right at, a week before Christmas because I was going to be gone and uh, I don't want anything going out without me looking over it and uh, and uh, making sure everything's correct and so we, we kind of held off on those but those will be going out and then mesh orders we've been working hard on getting those all together and uh, those should be going out a bunch of them should be going out Monday Tuesday Wednesday of next week. Uh, another thing you guys have been wondering is I didn't do any orders videos for mesh orders for Christmas because we were just trying to get them out as quick as we can. So because setting them all up on the table we would have to do it like four or five times um, and uh, more than once a day for that the two weeks leading up to Christmas. So we kind of just put them in and then threw them in a bag and got them right to the post office and 
Uh, a lot of you were really grateful because you were able to get Mesh very quickly for Christmas, and I, you guys sent me so many images and videos and everything um, of you guys getting the Mesh, which was awesome. I, I had a lot of fun watching them. I wasn't able to watch all of them yet because, as I said, I, my computer really wasn't uh, tip-top to be able to do all that and tweet to you guys and everything. So I'm going to try and get that. I have a bunch of ones that are just flagged. So if you guys sent me an email, and uh, I haven't emailed you back yet, um, it's flagged, and I'm going to get to it in the next few days um, just to make sure I get it to you guys. But uh, So we didn't do orders videos. I really just wanted to show the stringing videos because I know that's your guys' favorite. So I'm sorry if you guys really wanted to get an orders video. Um, I thought it was just uh, – I kind of made an executive decision. I thought it was more important to get you guys – the mesh than actually throw it in a video uh, for Christmas but as I said I had some awesome awesome uh, videos and photos and uh, it was nice because I was off Twitter for a few days and finally had time uh, to sit down and set up some new stuff and look at Twitter and I just had like 20 or 30 uh, tweets of Instagram photos of you guys doing it so that was that was really really special so I really appreciate you guys sending this stuff um, I always love it, it. You know, I really enjoy what I do. I actually love what I do, and uh, that's that's satisfaction enough. But seeing uh, you guys, you know, spending the time with your stick and being excited to you know go out and throw with your stick uh, makes it just that much uh, more special for me. And uh, so, thank you guys for sharing that with me. It always makes my day. And, you know, just kind of gives me like another boost of energy to uh, continue to create and and you know improve my products as best as I can for you guys. So that 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 was definitely awesome. Really appreciated that. Um, what else? I got to play some Far uh, Far Cry 3. It's like Skyrim with guns, I've heard, from like 50 people. It was pretty fun. I think I might pick it up. Um, I don't really have that much time to dedicate to games. That's why I really like kind of first-person shooters. I did play all the way through Skyrim, though, when it first came out, and I loved that. But I don't think I'll ever pick it up again just because it's I can't get consumed by it. But So I'm kind of afraid. It's weird. I, 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 if I find things I like, I try to be the best I can be at them. So... Video games are always a touchy subject because if I get one and I get, you know, just completely enthralled with it, I'm kind of screwed for everything else that I have to do because I do try and do a lot with my life. I, every day I try to do something unique and special and make that day worth it. And so video games are very tricky because when you're in them, they feel very, you know, you feel like you're accomplishing something and then you look back and you're like, I played this game 300 hours in two months. That, that's pretty pathetic. Um, so I don't know. I might live vicariously through YouTube videos of Far Cry, but it looks pretty sweet. Um, that's why I like to stick to like uh, first-person shooters because it's more round. You know, you play a few rounds, you do well, you can drop it and pick it back up. There's not as much as like lineage and story that you got to go through, but we'll see. I'll probably end up being frustrated and need a break from something. I'll probably end up picking it up. But uh, let me guys know what you think of it. Uh, it, it was fun. It was definitely fun. Uh, I don't know that many people that play it though, so I don't know if I'll have a full party. Like I played it with my cousin and stuff, so that was pretty cool because uh, it's all co-op. But we'll see what happens. Um, it was fun. The, the guns were a little dinky though, but that's because I'm used to games that they put all their money into game into gun design more so than story story design. But definitely cool. Um, what else happened? I don't know. The storm was crazy. It was a lot of fun. The heating broke in my room, so my room was like 50 degrees one, one or two nights. Um, <laughs> that was like entertaining for me. I was like, I was so bored I was able to do that. Um, I guess that's it, guys. So I wanted to update you about the orders and kind of Christmas stuff. Um, I'm going to do more for Message Monday on Monday uh, in terms of like actual stuff I got. I think you guys might enjoy that. And then also, because um, I got some cool stuff from Cascade. Uh, I'm supposed to get some cool stuff in from Sports Stop too. Um, that was supposed to—I don't know what happened. I was trying to figure out the tracking, but it's like can't find the uh, order confirmation. Uh, but I can give you guys a little update about what's coming up. Uh, while I was home, I did make a uh, Throne app, which um, I'm still making sure it's publishing. And everything's cool, but um, kind of with the new YouTube system and kind of how BS it is, um, I do like it in some ways, and also the the look of it's nice, but just to see like your videos and what you want to watch, it's kind of it's like three buttons to really get to it, and then it's not always accurate. So I made something to help you guys out, and it just connects us a little bit closer. Because I know a lot of people that just use YouTube for uh, my videos or just lacrosse videos, so I kind of wanted to make it a little bit easier for you guys, and that'll be available for Chrome and Firefox. So I I did that when I was home. That's that's pretty cool, and it looks awesome. So that should be coming up. Definitely a lot of stringing videos. Um, we're going to try and get like 20 heads done this, this weekend. Um, we're going to work pretty much Saturday and Sunday to get it all done. 
and uh, there's someone staring at me. It's really creepy. Should I stare back? Is that rude? She's kind of a crazy old lady, though. I feel kind of bad. I don't want to psych her out. All right, she's walking away. Okay, never mind. But, um... I don't know, it's weird doing videos in public, people just stare at you, like, I mean, I don't think I look crazy, but, I don't know, I could be FaceTiming or something, I, I don't know, anyway, but, so that's coming up, uh, videos, and then, we've got a lot of big picture stuff I'm working on right now, um, that I'm trying to balance, a lot of times when I get an idea, and I know you guys are going to love it, and I think it's just going to grow, like, the throne army that much more, I kind of just, uh, like, attack it, and try and make it the best it can be, um, but sometimes that that needs to go aside because we're st still a growing company and I still need to make sure um, that all the heads are right, all the orders are right, and that everyone's happy. And that's hard to do when um, you know you're answering so many emails and you know making sure everyone uh, uh, is getting the attention that they deserve, and then also trying to build um, on top of the foundation that we created. So a lot of cool stuff um, that I should be coming right before the season, if not sooner. Um, that I'm really excited about. I put a lot of sweat, blood, and tears into it already, and I can only see it getting greater from here, and also bringing some new people in to uh, uh, make cool stuff. So that's what I'm excited about. I'm excited not to just be me, um, and more so uh, uh, add some more facets to, uh, to Throne. So that's everything. It's getting kind of long, just because I'm so bored. I'm so <laughs> bored right now. Um, and there's no even food. I'm like in like the far, like uh, concourse. Um, yeah, concourse. And it's like there's no food over here. It's like all the baby planes, like the little pond jumpers or puddle jumpers, whatever you want to call it. So it's just so boring. Um, that's everything, guys. Hope you guys had a great Christmas. Uh, looking forward to the Message Monday. You can always throw me some uh, Message Monday questions now on Twitter at Throne of String with the hashtag Message Monday. Uh, I, I look forward to reading those or reading some comments and hearing what you guys got for Christmas. Uh, if you guys got Throne Mesh, you strung it up, and you haven't sent me a photo yet, I'd love to see it. Uh, always really enjoy that. And uh, that's everything, guys. And if you guys didn't know, we also trying to put a video together. Chris actually delivered a head to one of uh, our customers um, the two days before Christmas because uh, we finished this head. We saw that it was close by and wasn't going to get there and shipping, so he actually dropped it off on his way home and had, had to shoot around with them. And uh, that was pretty cool. So I'm trying to get videos. Uh, the parents took some videos. Chris took some videos. I'm trying to get them all together, share that with you guys, because it was like kind of just like one of those once in a lifetime uh, opportunities to make a really cool video, uh, and and just to show our appreciation here. So it, it was pretty sick. So that's everything, guys. Hope you had a great Christmas. Talk to you guys soon. And uh, I should probably see you next. Will be message Monday on Monday. Um, and I oh I got box tomorrow too, but it's supposed to snow like three inches. So that will probably be canceled. I hope it's not. I am dying to play some lacrosse. Um, I only got to pick my stick up once while I was home because I was playing hockey or it was snowing like pretty aggressively outside. And uh, I don't, like, yeah. But, uh, that's everything. Have a good one.